That voice is really, really nice. Feels good to react to something that's not a trailer. That's like most of my reactions have been lately have been trailers. Why have I always been a failure? What can the reason be? I wonder if the world's to blame. I wonder if it could. I love Charlie's character design. I love Vicky Pop's art style. I wonder if when the show is fully ready, if it's gonna have a theme song. I think that would be really cool. Oh, I'm alive! I'm alive! No, you're not. <laughs> Thanks for the fun time, hot stuff. Yeah, yeah, listen. Keep this discreet, you hear me? I can't let it get out. I'm offering my services to randos on the street. It was a quick cash grab. You got it? Whatever you say, slut. <laughs> Ouch! Ooh, such an insult. Let me know when you come up with something creative to call me, you sack of poorly packaged horse shit. Tell the missus I said hi. Schnuck him. Back up. Boom on The character designs are so unique. What? That there's not a super oh my simplistic. God. My drugs! Damn <laughs> so expressive too. Like that's such a way. Dare not hinder my territorial takeover. A wise decision. The power of my machines are unmatched. No other demon can compare to the likes of I. Gee. That was pretty swell, boss. Yeah! You really showed them what for. I liked when you shot them with your ray gun. I wish he'd shoot me with his ray gun. At this rate, I will seize control of the entire west side of the pentagram by day's end. And nothing, not a single beast in this inferno of suffering will be able to take back this empire from my constrictive grasp. Oh, Hell will be mine, and everybody will know the name of Sir Pe Death Lord! Pardon? Who said that? <laughs> what did you just say to me, you fried chicken fetuses? <laughs> You're gonna start calling eggs that. You're gonna start calling eggs that from now on. Looking for a fight, old man? Why don't you get that Tinker Toy bullshit off my turf before I smash it? Hers is probably one of my favorite oh, character designs. Here you go, Missy. Well, I'm happy to oblige. <laughs> I love the voice cast as well. Good afternoon. I'm Katie Killjoy. And I'm Tom Trench. Chaos out of Pentagram City today as a turf war is raging on the west side between notable kingpin Serpentius and self-proclaimed spunky powerhouse Cherry Bomb. That's right, Tom. After the recent extermination, many areas are now up for grabs. 
demons all over hell are already duking it out to gain new territory. Those two seem to really be going at it, huh? Looks like they're fighting tooth and nail for that hot spot. And I sure like to Well, she just ate a spot. tooth and a nail. <laughs> you are a lip dick jackass, Tom. Or should I say... No, Ew, I, I felt that. We oh, no, 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 no. With the daughter of Hell's own head honcho, who's here to discuss the her bone new passion song. project. Mm -hmm. All that and more after the break. Suck it up, you little bitch. <sighs> okay, you remember what to say? <gasps> yes, let's do this. Her Just character design is so adorable. Come on, Baggy, I know what to say. I just feel like we need to, I don't know, make things sound more exciting. Ooh, what if I sing? sing a song about it? You knew I was gonna say that. Because I know you, but please don't sing. This is serious. Well, I did actually know. record a reaction video of this a while back. Uh, the, I, it was actually the second time I ever watched it. Um, and it didn't, um... Uh, and it didn't um like the audio didn't record. Is this a drawing? Yes, that's the happy ending, see? Everyone's smiling and happy in heaven. I don't think it's that simple. Just please follow the talking points we went over. And do not sing. Okay, fine. I'll just have to result to my impeccable improv skills. Hi, I'm Charlie. Katie Killjoy. I'd say it's a pleasure to meet you, but that would be a lie. And you can put that away. I don't touch the gaze. I have standards. Okay. Yeah? How's, uh, how's that working out for you? Look, my time is money, so I'll keep this short. You're not here because we wanted you here. Bad touch, You're bad here touch. You're because Jeffrey couldn't make it for his cannibal cooking segment. You might be some royal big shot, but that doesn't mean shit to me. I'm too rich and too influential to give a flying fuck about what some tux wearing demon princess wants to advertise. But I... So don't get cute with me, honey, or I will fucking bury you. And we're live. Right. Welcome back. Go, Charlotte. It's Charlie. Whatever. Tell us about this new passion project you've been insistently pestering our news station about. Well. What the heck happened with that pen? <laughs> As most of you know, I was born here in hell and. Growing up, I always tried to see the good in everything around me. Hell is my home, and you are my people. We we just went through another extermination. We lost so many souls, and it breaks my heart to see my people being slaughtered She's just every sleeping. year. No one is even given a chance. I can't stand idly by while the place I live is subjected to such violence. So, I've been thinking. Isn't there a more humane way to hinder overpopulation here in hell? Perhaps we can create hey, a design up what so way to change or souls blitz. through redemption? Well, I think yes. So that's what this project aims to achieve. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm opening the first of its kind. A hotel that rehabilitates sinners. I love all these character designs. Is this girl for real? She thinks it. You hear what she thinks? She. <laughs> oh, she's nuts. I figure it would serve a purpose. A place to work towards redemption. Yay! <laughs> Stupid bitch. Look, every single one of you has something good deep down inside. I know you do. Maybe I'm not getting through to you. Oh no. Oh, here we go. Musical number time. Might have sing along. I need to tell about, about a wonderful, fantastic, fantastic new hotel. hotel. Yes, this is one of a kind right here in hell. To a specific clientele. Inside that of every demon is, is a rainbow. rainbow. Inside of every demon is a shiny smile. smile. It's Luna. Inside of every creepy angel, Luna's maniac is, is a highly happy, 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 happy child. We, we can turn, turn around. we will be heaven bound. A little time down, down at the happy hotel. I don't care. I'm not singing this part. <laughs> Oh, 
more fire and no more screams. And puppy dog kisses and cotton candy dreams. And puffy wuffy clouds that they would be like, wow, what's the seven with me? Nope, not even an attempt. <laughs> Ah, uh, see, I don't even know. Wow, that was shit. <laughs> <laughs> Denizen of hell would give two shits about becoming a better person. You have no proof that this little experiment even works. You want people to be good just because? Well, we have a patron already who believes in our cause and he's shown incredible progress. Oh, and who might that be? Oh, just someone named. Angel Dust? The porn star? You fucking would, Tom. In any case, that's not even an accomplishment. I'm sure you can get that hooker to do anything with enough booger sugar and lube. Oh, I bet That sound hurt. effect. Been oh. Behaved, clean, and out of trouble for two weeks now. Breaking news. We are receiving word that a new player has entered the ongoing turf war. Let's go to the live feed. Oh shit. Oh shit indeed. It looks like the one who just joined the battle is none other than porn actor Angel Dust. What a juicy coincidence. You must feel really stupid right now. <laughs> Ready? Don't look at this. Well, it sure looks like your little project is dead on arrival. Tell us. How does it feel to be such a total failure? <laughs> yeah, well, how does it feel that I got your pen, huh? Bitch! When I get into a fight with my friends, I have the crappiest comebacks. Hey, thanks for the backup, Angie. <laughs> Yo, kid, this is the best action I've seen in ages. Where you been anyway? I thought you up and died or some shit. Oh, I wish. I've been staying at this crappy hotel on the other side of town. Some boards are letting me stay rent free if I play nice. Ah. <sighs> you know, no fights, no pranks, no problematic language. Her words, not mine. <sighs> These crazy bitches are no fun. I've been clean for two weeks. Holy shit. Well, sort of clean. As clean as you can get with a shitload of Bolivian marching powder. <laughs> oh, harder, Daddy. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> I love the naiveness. You whores have no class. In war, the side remembered is the side with the most style. Or the side that ain't dead. Speaking of style, is your hat, like, alive or something? Oh, well, that's none of your goddamn business. Now is it? Would that make your hat the top and you the bottom? Mm. Was that a zipper sound effect? Oh, not like that, pervert! <laughs> not so cocky now, are we? You know, you really gotta watch what comes out of your mouth. Uh, I've been making these sex jokes the whole time, <laughs> and it's obvious you ain't catching on. I mean, it's just sex! So think you're gonna get in a lot of trouble for this? Eh, what's one little boy? Oh, she has suspenders? Uh, I like suspenders. How did he catch on fire? You know you're my favorite guy to party with. You know it, sugar tits. Are you ready to finish this? Born ready, baby. Very anticlimactic end to that right there. I'm gonna point out an animation error in a minute. What? 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 What were you doing? I owed 
my girl buddy a solid. Isn't that a redeeming quality? Helping friends with stuff? Not with turf wars that results in territorial genocide. Eh, you win some, you lose a few hundred. <laughs> it wasn't that bad anyway. Oh, come on, I had to. My Angel does like design reminds me of uh, I mean, what kind of reputation would I have if people found out I was home to go friends. It just throws out my entire persona. Your credibility? What about the hotels? Your little stunt made us look like a fucking joke. <laughs> no, 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 babe. Jokes are funny. I made you look uh, sad. And pathetic, like an orphan with no arms or legs. Uh, oh, with progeria. Great. Now I'm bummed thinking about it. This thing have any liquor? Can you please just try to take this seriously? Fine, I'll try. Just don't get your taco in a twist, baby. Was that you trying to be <laughs> sexist or racist? Whatever pisses you off more. Is there seriously no liquor in here? I'm gonna kill him. Too late, but wait. Would that make me double dead? <laughs> Where exactly do I go? To double hell? <laughs> Sorry, you're stuck with me, bitch. Get used to it. Listen, who cares if some Jagoffs got hurt? Most of them are ugly freaks. Look around. You got a bunch of fucking Harlequin babies down you're here. You're one to talk. Hey, this body is flawless. Oh. Everyone wants some of me, and I got the creepy fan that is to prove it. Oh, that's that was disturbing. really uncool, you know, Angel. Uncool? After that train wreck, there is no way anyone is gonna want to stay at the hotel. All thanks to you and your selfish bullshit. Does that mean I don't have a free room anymore? Ah, oh, well, shucks. Hey, come on. We don't know if things are over yet. Try to relax, Baggy. It'll be okay. I forgot a point of the animation there, but that was like a little bit where uh, Charlie takes her, she took her jacket off, and he, like in the one, sh one of those shots is back on. You know she didn't put it back on. It's probably a good idea to get some actual food in this place. You know, to feed all the wayward souls you got in here. <laughs> Still kind of rude, man. I know I keep calling, and uh, you must be busy. Really uh, busy. But, um, the interview didn't go well, and... Oh, they probably I saw. No, know if I'm going to make a difference. I don't know what I'm doing. I could really use some advice, Mom. I... I think Dad was right about me. <laughs> oh, anyway, I'll stop talking before this gets long. I was about to say, like, why would you watch your own kid that way? But look at who he is. That was a nice shot. I'm gonna let him in. May I speak now? You may. Alistair, pleasure to be meeting you, sweetheart. Quite a pleasure. Excuse my sudden visit, but I saw your fiasco on the picture show, and I just couldn't resist. What a performance! Why, I haven't been that entertained since the stock market crash of 1929. <laughs> so many orphans. Stop right there. Gawron equal to better. I know your game. And I'm not gonna let you hurt anyone here, you pompous, cheesy talk show shit lord. Dear, if I wanted to hurt anyone here, I would have done so already. I love that effect. The whole, like, static. No, I'm here because I want to help. To say what now? Help! <laughs> Hello? Is this thing on? Testing? Testing! Well, I heard you loud and clear. Um, you want to help? 
this ridiculous thing you're trying to do. This hotel! I want to help you run it. But... Why? <laughs> Why does anyone do anything? Sheer, absolute boredom! I've lacked inspiration for decades. My work became mundane, lacking focus. Aimless! I've come to crave a new form of entertainment! <laughs> Does getting into a fist fight with a reporter count as entertainment? <laughs> it's the purest kind, my dear. Reality! True passion! After all, the world is a stage, and the stage is a world of entertainment. So why isn't that why is that last bit like did not have the the radio voice? <laughs> of course not. That's wacky nonsense. Redemption. Oh, the non-existent humanity. No, 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 no. I don't think there's anything left that could save such loathsome sinners. The chance given was the life they lived before. The punishment is this. There is no one doing what is done. So then, why do you want to help me if you don't believe in my cause? Consider it an investment in ongoing entertainment for myself. I want to watch the scum of the world struggle to climb up the hill of betterment, only to repeatedly trip and tumble down to the fiery pit of failure. Right. Yes, indeedy. I see big things coming your way, and who better to help you than I? Uh, so, uh, what's the deal with smiles over there? Wait, you've never heard of him before? You've been here longer than me. The radio demon. One of the most powerful beings Hell has ever seen. Eh, not big on politics. Ugh. Decades ago, you I and me both, Angel. Hell, seemingly overnight, you began to well, topple nice. overlords who had been dominant for centuries. That kind of raw power had never been harnessed by a mortal soul before. Then he broadcast his carnage all throughout Hell, just so everyone could witness his ability. Sinners started calling him the Radio Demon. As lazy as that is. Many have speculated what unimaginable force enabled him to rival our world's most ancient and destructive evils. But one thing's for sure. He's an unpredictable source of danger, a wicked spirit of mystery, and a violent monster of chaos, the likes of which we can't risk getting involved with unless we want to end up erased. You're done. <laughs> he looks like a strawberry pimp. <laughs> strawberry well, I don't pimp. trust him. To be fair, do you trust any man? Any men? <laughs> men? Charlie, listen to me. You can't believe this creep. He isn't just a happy face. He's a deal maker. Pure evil. He can't be redeemed. And is most likely looking for a way to destroy everything we're trying to do. I... We don't know that. Look, I know he's bad, and I know he probably doesn't want to change. But the whole point of this is to give people a chance. To have faith, things will be better. How can I turn someone away? I can't. It goes against everything I'm trying to do. Good for you. Everything I believe in. Just trust me. I can take care of myself. Charlie, whatever you do, do not make a deal with him. Don't worry. I picked up one thing from my dad. You don't take shit from other demons. Okay, so, now, you're sketchy as fuck, and you clearly see what I'm trying to do here as a joke. But I don't. I think everyone deserves a chance to prove they can be better, so I'm taking your offer to help. On the condition that there be no trickster voodoo strings attached. So it's a deal, then? Nope. No shaking, no deals. I... Hmm. As princess of hell and heir to the throne, I, uh, hereby order that you help with this hotel for as long as you desire. Uh, sound fair? Hmm. Fair enough. Cool beans. <laughs> Smile, my dear! You know you're never fully dressed without one. <laughs> So where is your hotel staff? Uh, well... Oh, you're going to need more than that. And what can you do, my effeminate fellow? I can suck your dick. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> your loss. Oh, God, so how many times I hear that, it makes me I laugh. I suppose I can cash in a few favors to liven things up. 
I love her voice. Read them and weep, boys. Tell? What the fuck is this? You. Ah, Husker, my good friend. Glad you could make it. Don't you Husker me, you son of a bitch. I was about to win the whole damn pot. Good to see you too. What the hell do you want with me this time? My friend, I am doing some charity work, so I took it upon myself to volunteer your services. I hope that's okay. Are you shitting me? Hmm. No, I don't think so. <laughs> you thought it would be some kind of big fucking riot just to pull me out of nowhere? You think I'm some kind of fucking clown? Maybe. I ain't doing no fucking charity job. Well, I figured you would be the perfect face to man the front desk of this fine establishment. With your charming smile and welcoming energy, this job was made for you! Don't worry, my friend. I can make this more welcoming. If you wish. What? You think you can buy me with a wink and some cheap booze? Well, you can! Hey! Hey! <laughs> hey, hey, hey. No. No bar. No alcohol. This is supposed to be a place that discourages sin! Not some kind of... now... Brothel man king? Shut up! Shut up! We are keeping this. Hey. Go fuck yourself. Only if you watch me. Oh my gosh. Yeah, he, Angel is definitely talking about Husker, not the alcohol. I lost the ability to love years ago. So, what do you think? This is amazing! It's okay. <laughs> this is going to be very entertaining. <laughs> you have a dream. dream. You, you wish it how? And it's a lot of What the hell? There's no one of a kind. A charming demon bell. Now let's give these birds a place to dwell. Take it, boys. Son of every demon is our lost cause. No love now, just the spars. Well, well, well. Look who it is harboring the striped freak. We meet yet again, Alastor. Do I know you? Oh, yes, you do. And this time I have the element of surprise. <laughs> I'm so evil. I think you would know how powerful Alistair is. I'd be smart enough not to attack. What the heck was up those yokes looking things? showed me a wonderful recipe for jambalaya. In fact, it nearly killed her. <laughs> you could say the kick was right out of hell. Oh, I'm on a roll. Oh, it's adorable yes, seeing her get all hyped up like real that. Changes down here. The game is set. Now. Stay tuned. Oh, that was good for me to do a reaction video on. I actually am actually very glad that I did a reaction to that. It's been a while. So I recognize any of these voice actors. Yeah, I know uh, Black Griffin did uh, 
Wait, uh, wait, 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 was that who I think that was? Wait. I know, uh, Black Griffin is the singing voice for, um, Alistair. Yeah. Gabriel C. Brown, yeah. I don't know any of these names. Alright. Let's I'm not surprised this has this much uh, stuff because of the fact of how long this took and it already had a following before the first episode was even out and this show still has a big following and a big fandom based on this one pilot, one music video and obviously it's other shows in the same universe. Oh, oh, it's an after credit. I've never seen this, actually. I don't think I have, at least. Now will you shoot me with your ray gun? Oh. Uh. So, I got to see something new, actually. I've never seen that little after credit scene. Um, that was a, that was a lot of, uh, interesting things that just got thrown at me. Um. So, um, uh, there's a, so there's a lot to unpack with this reaction, obviously. I got, this is my fourth, third, four, one of my multiple times of seeing this. I watched it multiple times at this point. Um. I do intend to react to the addict or addicted or whatever the, I don't even know at this point uh, what it's called. But that music video I didn't react to, to that and all the episodes of Hell of a Boss so far. Um, um, so the first... I don't know when I'm going to get those reactions going. Um, but yeah, that's going to be it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!